Hey, this is Ray Dombrowski. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to apply texture styles to your graphics in Adobe Illustrator. These are vector texture patterns that work especially well with type, lettering, and logos. So here I have the texture styles file open in Adobe Illustrator and there's two artboards. On the left artboard, you'll see 20 different texture options, and on the right artboard is an example graphic. And to apply a different texture, all you need to do is grab your eyedropper tool and sample any of the textures that you see on the left artboard. So I like this one, it's called Vertical Lines and it just applies a nice distressed texture to your design. So now what I'll do is I'll show you how to apply the textures to your own graphics. So I'm gonna go into a logo template here I have that's part of the T-Shirt Design Master Collection 2 bundle. Let me go ahead and select this and copy it. Let me get rid of this example graphic and I'll paste in that logo template and let's go ahead and scale it down. In general, you wanna fit your graphic to the size of the artboard. That way, the scale of the textures is pretty much in line with most things you'd wanna do. But first, let's make sure that we have our preferences correct. So let's go into Adobe Illustrator Preferences, General Preferences, and make sure Transform Pattern Tiles is on. So when you scale your graphic, you want the texture to scale along proportionately with it. The other thing we wanna do is, like I said, these are pattern tiles. So let's go into our swatches panel and open that up. So go window swatches, and you'll see I have this in large list view mode. It, I think it defaults to small thumbnail, but um, if you change it to large list view, you'll be able to see the names of the textures and it's a lot easier to navigate. So back to our logo here. The one thing you wanna do is if you have any strokes in your graphic, you wanna change those to outline. And you can do that by just going object, expand, and then just click okay. The nice thing about these texture styles is that they work on live type. So just to show you that, I'll go in here and change this to texture styles. And we will apply texture the exact same way we did before, just by highlighting this graphic and then getting our eyedropper tool. And we can sample these textures off to the left. There's some vertical half tones. I really like number 20 texture, the grunge speckle. So these textures are pattern tiles and all of the pattern tiles are black. So if you wanna change the color, what you're gonna to need to do is go in and edit the pattern tiles, which is actually really easy. So what I'll do is I'll just make a copy of this grunge speckle by dragging it down to this little sheet icon here at the bottom of the swatches window. And you'll see that makes a new pattern tile. And let's go ahead and double click on this thumbnail. And it opens up a window that allows us to edit this pattern tile. So just go in there and select that pattern tile, and now you can change the color of it. So here's my color window, and I'll just change that to like a dark red. And just double click on the artboard to get out of this edit mode. And now we're back in the regular file, and what we can do is let's select this border, and we'll select the palm tree, and we'll assign those the new red pattern tile. So that's about it. Texture styles are part of T-Shirt Design Master Collection 2. To find out more about that, click the link on your screen. Thanks for watching.